Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches. I'm Fred Woods, ready to teach. Here's the problem of the day for Mr. Woods Teaches. Hi friends, welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches Number Talks. Hey, today I'm with my good friend, Wendy, also known as Corgi Legs. Hey, so Wendy has three songs to sing. She signed up for eight performances. How many songs did Wendy sing in all her performances? That one's a little more difficult than what you've seen. How do you think you should do this? I don't know. Let's take a look at a strategy that might be useful for you. Okay, mathematicians. I put down here the number of songs she needs to sing and the number of performances. How would you complete this? Let me show you. Okay, friends, you see how I completed this? Remember, I have three songs and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight performances. Thus, I have a three and an eight. Have you seen something like this before? You ever heard of a matrix or an array? Hmm. How do you solve this? There's so many different ways. Let's take a look at a couple of them. Okay, how do you think Corgi Legs, I mean Wendy, solved this problem? Well, there's different ways she could have done it. She could have added three eight times, so three plus three plus three. That, that takes a while. This is a little bit shorter, eight plus eight plus eight, but still. Then we have three times eight. Well, wait a minute. That's the same as saying three times eight, or eight times three. There's eight three times. Hmm. You know what the answer is yet? Well, eight times three, three times eight, eight plus eight plus eight, and three added eight times is equal to 24. So, Wendy, I should say Corgi Legs, she sang 24 songs in over eight performances. Until next time, this is Mr. Woods Teaches. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. Here's a preview of the next number talk with Mr. Woods Teaches.